Hello guys, it's Cody. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to add a iPhone 15 frame to your screenshots. So you just get this shortcut. Uh, I sh I'll share the shortcut link, iCloud link in the description. You just uh, tap get shortcut and you have this shortcut. Uh, you import it to your shortcuts gallery uh, and this shortcut uh, already have it. So it's this one, as you can see. Uh, get device model if the device is Mac. So this will also work on your Mac. So you can uh, oh, run this on your Mac. As you select a uh, iPhone screenshot, and this will add a iPhone fifteen frame. So let me just uh, run it. I'll select a screenshot. Let me just select this one. Okay. Allow it display notification successfully. Check the result. Should be saved to camera roll. It's here. This one. Okay. You see here? at the uh, iPhone 15 frame so let me just also this uh, the it's, it's black it's hard to see so I'm just gonna add a frame to this screenshot right from share sheet is this one enable share sheet let me check it is this uh, Uh, this has is not enabled in share sheet so let me just uh, enable it in share sheet showing share sheet of course let me select images files okay Otherwise, select photos. So this works with multiple images. iPhone, let me just uh, add the effect. If shortcut input has any value, set a variable. Get a wearable, get a wearable. Let's go. Get a wearable shortcut input. Otherwise, select photos. Select another variable. And if the variable images to if result. So we should resize. No need to set a variable, yes, it seems. So no need to set a variable. Set it anyway. I'm just running from share sheet. Scroll down to iPhone 50 frame. Always allow successfully. See here. That's it. You can. And a frame, iPhone 15 frame to any of your screenshot. Okay, that's uh, pretty much it for this video. Hope you find it helpful. As always, thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next one.